Welcome back to Voxvote. You can uh, use the quiz option now in Voxvote and I will explain and show you how to do the and run the quiz. First of all, you have to create an account. I have already a test account available and some test question. Uh, before going to the uh, quiz option itself, I will add another uh, question. We press the add question and for example, we have a question um, how many bytes are in a kilobyte? You can have all kinds of questions as long as uh, your audience is trained. It could be a fun question or uh, a kind of question you uh, like. We don't use the color system yet. Uh, we'll do it uh, later on. If you want to have another question modus, question option, you can press the additional buttons. Uh, on the right hand I has opened already two uh, test devices. I now marked the question 1204 1, as the correct answer. So all the results will be shown in green, but the correct answer is uh, 1024 bytes in a kilobyte. I don't use the preview for testing, I do the live mode, but make sure, and you can see that also in earlier videos, uh, you can have a test mode itself. The questions will only uh, show up if the start button is pressed. Um, the pin code for the users is 48070 and as I start, the, your audience, and in this case the test results, are broadcasted uh, to all the device. On the top left corner you can see the screen is on air and all the questions are now uh, visible. So this is a test user and this answer is already sent now to the uh, central uh, server and deliberately a wrong answer. But there are many more uh, test users in this environment. I usually Two visible now, but actually there are eight users in this uh, uh, test. You see two uh, devices um, on the right screen for the video, but an eighth uh, is also visible there. So half of my audience does know it uh, will is one thousand. But you don't. The audience doesn't yet see uh, how much persons uh, has the correct answer. That's for later on. But you can also add another color question. Now, was Albert Einstein born before Napoleon Bonaparte? If you really remember, uh, you have seen pictures of Albert Einstein, but I've never seen a photo picture from Napoleon because he was painted. So uh, Napoleon was much older. And this audience doesn't have it really correct. Um, I'm waiting for the eighth user to vote. Will it be worse? And now you can see the correct answer. Oh, this is uh, wrong color coding. Correct answer is of course false. Should be the green color. Now this is a special question as a test question. And if I press the start button, then the third, the second question will be broadcasted. This is a tricky question because uh, the Foxhot is developed in the Netherlands. Um, the tricky question, and you already know, Amsterdam is the capital of uh, the Netherlands, but The Hague is where the ministries and the politicians are heading, their main office. Another question example, the famous Dutch painter Vincent van Gogh, you can pick one of those uh, questions, and you can see here is a multiple choice. So the uh, this person and none of these is an opt-out but you can see later on five users more most of the users and now deliberately not the night watch on another device is of course not from Van Gogh but it's from Rembrandt and we see a wrong answer but the audience doesn't yet know if this is the correct answer because that's hidden you can have a green or red color if you want you can do it yourself this is a question and at the end, because it's anonymous voting, we have the option to display uh, or ask for the audience to enter the information about who am I. All the quiz, quiz information is also described um, and 
you can have them ask for an email address, but you can also ask for fake email addresses. Uh, if you add at fake dot fake or at nep dot nep in Dutch, then you uh, see the non scrambled answers. We will explain later on if you see the quiz results. So on the mobile devices or on the apps, the audience can type in their uh, name and I put in fake dot fake. And on this device, I put in a normal email address and it will be scrambled because we don't want the audience to be share the, their email addresses with you. But we want to pick a winner. So if we pick the winner, the uh, a part of the email address is more of the time uh, sufficient. So you have to um, allow the audience to take some time to enter their email addresses. Don't do it too fast. And when you're ready, you can go to the quiz results uh, where you can have an export or a live result from the winners. So we had four questions. And uh, one of two of them are tied. They are both ranked number one. And we have uh, uh, two winners on alphabetical form. So the winner could be highlighted if you want to show it uh, on the main screen, if you are on a conference center, a goodie bag. You can display it or copy and paste it to your uh, Excel. You can do it directly in um, uh, PowerPoint, or you can do the export to Excel. I will show it later on. Yeah, you can win it. It's for free. There's also an, an option because the Excel, the list left list is displayed um, only uh, for the top 50, but the Excel export uh, uh, with quiz data uh, can be found there. If you are, uh, you can also have all the details as well in the normal export, but this is just the calculated quiz risk quiz quick. So we have eight users. We didn't use the uh, preview mode. As a beginner, I would advise to start with preview, but we have the live modus uh, with live audience. This is again how it looks like. We can review this, the, the questions and the results. Then there are some other settings. Uh, if you're ready, you can archive your product uh, and automatically send an email summary to your audience. Now the, the item is archived and you can also see the results uh, or share it with your audience uh, uh, directly on the web or in a link. Or you can hide it if you want, if you want to have the private results. You can read about the the crossing information in the website or go back to uh, Fox Salad themselves. Thank you for watching and there will be more videos available soon. Let us know if you have questions.